Donald Trump facing new criticism for something he did on the campaign trail last night in South Carolina while defending his debunked claim that he saw thousands of Muslims celebrate the collapse of the Twin Towers here in New York. He appeared to mock a reporter with a disability. Take a look. Written by a nice reporter. Now the poor guy, you got to see this guy. Oh, I don't know what I said. Uh, I don't remember. He's going like, I don't remember. I, oh, maybe that's what I said. This is 14 years ago. He still, they didn't do a retraction. That reporter he is talking about is Serge Kovaleski, who now works for the New York Times. As you can see right there, he suffers from a chronic condition that impairs movement of his arms. A Times spokesman says they find it outrageous that Trump would ridicule the man's appearance. Donald J. Trump is calling for a total and complete shutdown of Muslims entering the United States until our country's representatives can figure out what the hell is going on. Your comments about banning Muslims from entering the country created a firestorm. According to Facebook, it was the most talked about moment online of your entire campaign, with more than 10 million people talking about the issue. Is there anything you've heard that makes you want to rethink this position? No. No. First of all, Rand Paul shouldn't even be on this stage. He's number 11. He's got 1% in the polls. And how he got up here, there's far too many people. I kind of have to laugh when I think of, hmm, sounds like a non sequitur. He was asked whether or not he would be capable and it would be in good hands to be in charge of the nuclear weapons. And all of a sudden, there's a sideways attack at me. I think that really goes to really the judgment. Do we want some with that kind of character, that kind of careless language? to be negotiating with Putin. Do we want someone like that to be negotiating with Iran? I think really there's a sophomore quality that is entertaining about Mr. Trump, but I am worried. I'm very concerned about him having him in charge of the nuclear weapons because I think his response, his, his visceral response to attack people on their appearance, short, tall, fat, ugly, my goodness, that happened in junior high. Are we not way above that? And would we not all be worried to have someone like that in charge of the nuclear Jake, arsenal? Jake, the, Mr. Trump. I never attacked him on his look. And believe me, there's plenty of subject matter right there. That I can tell you. But Jake, Jake, I wanna, Jake, Jake. I want to give Jake, Mr. Trump. When do we beat Mexico at the border? They're laughing at us, at our stupidity. And now they're beating us economically. They are not our friend, believe me. But they're killing us economically. They're rapists. You've called women you don't like fat pigs, dogs, slobs, and disgusting animals. Your Twitter account Only is Rosie several... O'Donnell. No, it wasn't. No, it's, it's her. It's her. Yeah, that's her, with the gold. I better use some Tic Tacs just in case I start kissing her. You know, I'm automatically attracted to beautiful. I just start kissing them. It's like a magnet. I just kiss. <laughs> I don't even wait. And when you're a star, they let you do it. You can do anything. Whatever you want. Grab them by the pussy. <laughs> I can do anything. He called this woman Miss Piggy. Then he called her Miss Housekeeping because she was Latina. Donald, she has a name. Where did you find her? Her name Where is did Alicia you find this? Machado. He was clearly upset. Yo fui la primera Miss Universo de, de Mr. Trump. Cuando él compró la empresa. Me imponía mucho. Yo le tenía mucho miedo. Me gritaba todo el tiempo. Me, me decía, you look ugly. O te ves gorda. O, o a veces jugaba conmigo y me decía, hello, Miss Piggy. O me decía, hello, Miss Housekeeping. So, uh, uh, Donald, mm. all right, I, I'm, I'm afraid to ask this question, but what would you do, Playboy put Ivanka on the cover of the magazine if she had not... This is going to be an interesting answer. <laughs> <laughs> she, he doesn't even want you to have a drink. I know him, so... It would be really disappointing. Not really. <laughs> but it would depend on what was inside the magazine. If, oh, no, if oh. she posed, it would be fine. But if they put her picture yeah, on... Yeah, but it depends on what goes inside the magazine. Well, see, that's her gripe. Right. That's right. this girl's gripe. And, mm -hmm. and People assume nothing. there'll be nude, nude photos. Right, you do assume Misleading. that with Playboy. Okay, she, if there weren't, Playboy... you wouldn't have an issue with it then. If yeah. they were using her to... I don't think Ivanka would do that inside the magazine, although she does have a very nice figure. I've said that if Ivanka weren't my daughter, perhaps I'd be dating her. You know? <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> 